we factor the youngster into this tiebreaker here at the Memorial Cup, Ray? Well, he's going to have to be a difference maker because uh, your better players are the ones you turn to in in this situation. You're, you've got it's one game and you go through, or one game and you go home. And yeah, sure, there's always a Cinderella story, some guy that scores a goal or makes a save that you never count on. But at this point, man, you're you're looking for your best guys to lead the way, and he absolutely age doesn't matter. All right, more Memorial Cup action. We're going up against the Sioux City Greyhounds. I believe it's Sioux City. Uh, the Greyhounds, that's all I know. And we're facing Bailey Birkin in the net. Man, look at that dude's neck. Oh my goodness. Is that real? <laughs> my, he has a pencil for a neck. We got that nine. Oh, did we sim a game? Oh, we sim to the next big event, so it did give us... Right, we sim to the next big event, so that's going to help us out with the uh, save percentages and stuff. I didn't think about it. I, did, I just skipped simming to the next game, and so that would, I guess, explain it. Oh, oh just wide. Oof. Right off the bat, we're already facing a shot. Oh, where was that shot going? That was not even close. Well, I'm very thankful it takes the pressure off me when you shoot like that. It's keeping me guessing. I don't know where it's going next. I think that's the whole objective with that. I do not feel comfortable with my defense. Playing it at that blue line. That was a nice save up into the up into the glass beyond the net off the glove. Lawrence. Oh, back hitter. Oh, a second try. And Birkin. Standing tall early in this game. Lawrence with the best opportunity so far for the Sea Dogs. I haven't really been tested yet. I had that one shot that went way wide. And other than that, I haven't actually seen anything on net. So, slow start to this game. Kokov behind the net to Burns. Burns in front. Oh, the wraparound. He almost wrapped that right past him. Wow. So, I haven't seen really any action in this game to this point. But maybe we see our first shot here. Okay. Oh, there it is. Off the post. Wow. I'm just not playing my angles tonight. Oh, 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 oh. Ooh. Man, so still not an official shot on the net. But another lucky post. Let's see if McKay gets one off this time. It hits the net. There's our first save on McKay. He got that one through my defense. So I had to peer through my defenseman. Uh-oh. I don't really like where that was going. Mark that post. Oh, don't come off of it yet. Oh, off the net. I think that went off the side of the net. I'm not liking this. Big save on the one-timer. And we're just going to melt that down. Don't let them get anything set up. It is. Oh, the slap shot right there. I think that... Is that... Was that the first shot that we saw? It didn't go into the corner like that, did it? Maybe I'm remembering things wrong. I don't know. Let's play it. <laughs> just because there's a guy there. I have help. Oh, that shot never came close. Dickinson drops for a Ligurier. Oh, it rolls in on me, but I got help. Kind of. Probably shouldn't have put him in that situation there. Uh-uh. No. Oh, yes. Tracking that puck perfectly. That was fantastic. Not a sequence I wanted to experience, but the saves were great. And we just go offside. We're going to see the replay, I think of what we just did yes we are it's the first save but then the second one attacking the puck as well in the butterfly that is not easy to do Poirier a shot turn this side into the corner Gerard back to his point man downloaded Gerard to Lawrence in the corner with it taken away by Trot I lost track of that puck already Dickinson a shot wide and it might be a breakaway oh Reynolds you should have pushed for that Stays with it. Oh, very physical. Reynolds, turn around, he scores! And that's why you stay with the puck as Reynolds scores. He was getting very physical on offense. And then he just gathered it, turned, and shot. I guess he was screened. He was. Birkin couldn't exactly track that puck all the way. And it goes in. And we have the early one to nothing lead. But again, just like the first time we played, it came late in the period, so 
early in the game, but late in the period once again. Hopefully this is not a repeat of the first Memorial Cup game we played. Across the blue, looking, there's a shot. Oh man, what a snipe. And a great snipe by O'Rourke. Maybe I was off angle, but that's gonna tie the game. Can we see it just one more time? I mean, I felt like I was there just dropping the butterfly. And instead of tracking it into the glove, it's like he was just trying not to get hit by it. And you can see how deep, I guess, we were in the crease as well. But there's no reason you shouldn't be making a save off of that. That should be a save. There, that is a savable, stoppable shot. And they just come right back the other way and answer. And we're tied once again. And it rolls in on Burke, and he doesn't know where it is. He's going to get a whistle. They have done McKay. Slap shot and a save. He loves to rip that one. He will step right into it. He is not hesitating to step right into those shots. Burns down low in the corner for Kotkov. He's got help at the point, but he doesn't use it. Doesn't need it. One-timer, and Francis scores. On the other side, nifty puck movement from the Sea Dogs, and they are going to take a 2-1 lead late in the first period. He's just standing there Ovechkin style, and that has reclaimed the lead with 146 remaining in the period. Fantastic work, guys. And that's why you just stay resilient. I gotta stay resilient on my end of the ice and do my job in the net and prevent them from putting rubber in the back of it. Karen's with it toward the corner. He's probably looking for that low to high play. Let's not let him have it. Good defensive work. Just taking him off the puck. It gets out, and that is the end of the first period of play. And I would say that the Sea Dogs outplayed the Greyhounds. The scoreboard would certainly reflect that. But we'll also see the shot totals in just a short second. As you can see, we were not really tested. 14 on the net for the Sea Dogs, only 5 for the Greyhounds. But crucially, one of those 5 Greyhounds shots ended up in the back of our net so it's a lot tighter game than it really should be but can the greyhounds manage to start to put some pucks on the net and stay in this game they're not, they are not out of it by a long shot the sea dogs are going to have to start putting more of that rubber in the back of the net with that many shot attempts down low behind the net i never like when they do this oh good job by francis Greyhounds looking, probably centering it. Oh, trying a desperation save because I just did not know what was going to happen. And we were definitely out of position on that. Francis the other way just misses the net. Oh, my. And Francis is there to pick it up. Kotkov a shot and a save by Birkin. Face off one back to Poirier. He shoots well wide of the net in the corner with it. That Kia logo is new, and I still don't see Kia when I look at it. It looks like a K and an N. Tell me it doesn't. It does not look like that says Kia. It looks like it says K and N. I guess EA has removed their Honda sponsorship partnership, and it's now with Kia. Wow, Rao. Am I seeing that name right? Wow, Rao. Is that his name? Reynolds is in. He scores on the breakaway. As I was not moving the camera forward, I was stuck in my own end with the camera. But Reynolds scores on the breakaway. His second of the game. Third of the Memorial Cup. Reynolds, he's, he's... What is that defenseman doing? He is skating backwards the whole way. Turn around and back check, my friend. Number 21. What are you doing? He's skating backwards the whole way there. Like, hey, where's the guy at? He has no idea that Reynolds is in all alone. He could have prevented that breakaway and made it at least a partial breakaway instead of a full breakaway. But I'm not complaining and nor are the Sea Dogs. We have now claimed a 3-1 lead on Reynolds' second of the game. And he shoots, tries to drag and shoot and miss the net. Just why? And Wow Rao with it. I am probably not saying that name correct. But Wow Rao out to Karens. We have not been tested. We have hardly seen anything in this game. 19 shots to five. This is so unbalanced, this game right now. One has gotten past us, which is gonna affect the save percentage unless we start seeing some pucks on the net. And that one misses as well. 
to the point. Rude, a shot, low shot save. Couple of saves off all those rebounds and a post included for good measure by Reynolds. A turnaround by, Ren by Lawrence is wide. It rolls in. That's going to be my defenseman. He's got it. Villeneuve has it. Oh, pulls up. Passes for Johnson. A save. Stay with it. Oh, right there. I got a defenseman. <laughs> oh, oh no. Oh, you guys, you idiots. And that is not on me. You cannot blame that on me. That is a turnover into a goal. I was not expecting or even ready for the turnover. Right there. Oh, man. That sucks big time. I, that's not even my fault. You can see I'm trying to just get ready for the... You've got to be ready for a turnover at all times. There's no excuses. But there's also no excuses for them to just turn it over like that in their own end of the ice. Oh, oh god. EA? EA? There, there's gameplay going on? Sinking what? What do I do? What do I do? It says it's sinking. Is this so... What is this? When it happens, pause your game, go to settings, select side, select the center option where you are just a spectator, then wait for a whistle. It should load then. Okay, it's loaded in now. We're good. I'm lucky I didn't get scored on because the game was going on. What in the world? EA Sports, man. This is, I would expect nothing less from EA Sports. Oh, that's a big save. Ooh, tracking it on weird angles is just strange. That's a delayed penalty against the Greyhounds. And the Sea Dogs are going to go on the power play now, as there was a slash in front. And it's Johnson is the guilty party. Right there, as I was playing it. So probably very smart 200 IQ play to move that puck to draw the penalty. And now we go on the power play. We'll work with it. Let's see if the Greyhounds clear it, or if they, they do. That's going to be me to play it. I got it off the glass and out. No one's at center to play that. Great going, guys. Good communication. Oh, oh my lordy Lou, what are you guys doing? I was just trying to take away the net so the puck doesn't go in. And you guys are all stumbling in front of me. Leonard for Lawrence. Oh, interrupted pass and play. That's all me. I'm going to get here in the corner, in the behind the net. I can't play it. Moving it off the glass and around. Lawrence is there, thankfully. Can get a shot. He does. A rebound off that save and a second chance. Here comes Trot. Does he dump it in? This AI isn't dumping it in. What am I talking about? Trot a shot wide. No, I don't even know what to do. Do I go down? Go down like this. And then move from post to post. Oh, he couldn't handle it. They would have had a great opportunity on the net. Oh, nice play to Francis. He just missed it wide, but you know what he wants to do with it. Shot. And a save. Good composed save. As they try to move it back to the point. Down, back to trot. Probably it for me to tell you how to play offense. Oh, nice. I don't know if that was a save or went wide, but it was a good looking shot. Burns pinned against the board. That might just be how we'll end the period. It will. It, it'll, yep, that's it. So we're up 4 to 2 at the end of 2. And it has been all Sea Dogs. 29 shots through two periods of play, four goals, only 11 shots for the Greyhounds. So the Sioux Greyhounds are not putting a whole lot of an offensive effort up, but despite the lack of shots, they still have two goals. Oh, off the post. As I'm moving all over the shot, I just gotta compose myself a little bit here. Just wide. Oh, I don't like when they get it down below the net because of that weird angle, big save. No, no! Oh, that's gonna count? He was in my crease. Oh, oh, what an awful game. I had it, and then if you just, if you morons stop, it doesn't go in. Oh, not a fun game at all. Not fun. Another three goals against. And I've only seen like 12 shots. So I say let these guys ramp it up on offense. Because my save percentage is just tanking at this point. <laughs> That's a shot. How is that not a shot? You have a clear lane on the net. Why don't you take it? Not on the all-star difficulty. There's the shot. Oh, how do you not connect on that? Five hole. Are you kidding? I And I dropped. Or at least I felt like I dropped. Just 
Just need to go home and rethink my life. How does that go in? And we're tied. We are tied. I am not getting drafted first overall. I'll be lucky to even get drafted in this game. Save. A miracle. We made a save. It's a Christmas miracle. An Easter miracle. Any saves from here on in are just bonuses. Just bonus points. Gonna have nightmares about that Pitlick snipe. It should have never gotten past me. That one doesn't even hit the net. Are you kidding me? Guy can snipe at five hole and then the next shift can't even hit the net. You want me to be clutch late in the game? You were picking the wrong guy. McKay, I actually stopped one five hole. It's a miracle. We're starting to improve statistically. Kotkov, the cut to the middle. Pulls up. Tried to find Francis. It was definitely there. It's the other way. Shot. And it's blocked away into the corner. But who's going to get there first? The Greyhounds maintain pressure. McKay wide. And I don't know what's going to happen with it. So I'm going to seal. Oh, no. Oh, I got alert. I got to learn not to trust this team. They don't know what they're doing with it. And it's another turnover that leads straight into a goal. And it went from clutch time to we need a goal now. Five goals on roughly 15 shots. It is just bad. When it rains, it freaking pours. I could just play that puck for XP, but it's not going to let me now. Because my teammates get to it. Why don't you guys turn it over? And uh, let them score another goal on me. That just make me feel better about myself. Francis. He can't shoot it through Wow Rao, if I'm saying his name correctly. Face off one by the Sea Dogs, and that shot never came close. Oh, no. I, I don't know why that's got to happen to me. A pull up, the pass across, the save, a power play. We may just have a chance. Interference, we need to score off of this power play. Face off one. The Sea Dogs one timer save. Take this game to overtime. Played off the. I, I'm just playing catch with the other team with that one. I don't know what I'm doing. Cleared by the Greyhounds, but settled by their goaltender. I was very lucky because that was a blind pass from going the length of the ice. I got it. Breakout pass. Oh, it's perfect to Kotkov. He centers it for Reynolds. Shot blocked away. A minute left on the power play. And it's cleared the length again, but knocked down by the goaltender. Sent the length. And the Greyhounds will just get it back again in offensive territory. On this gifted power play, we need the extra man. We need the extra man. The six on four. It's cleared. It's going to roll in for me. I'm going to try to move. Oh, no. Oh. Please get up. Shoot. Shoot. Oh, and he catches it. It was a weird knuckleball. The Greyhounds could use another power play. Or sorry, the Sea Dogs could use another power play. The goaltender's been pulled. I have no choice in this. It is time. It is go time. Now I just watch from the bench. Go, Francis. Push the tempo. 42 seconds. Can we maybe force overtime? Trot goes for the empty net. He misses. It's behind the net. Poirier picks it up. Still a chance. We're not dead yet. Oh, Savoy, stay with it. Breakaway. They score! Five to five. It's tied. Thanks to Francis and a miracle with the extra attacker and the empty net. Ryan Francis is going to tie it. The chance, the rebound, and he shovels it home. We are going to be seeing an extra frame, a second life for the Sea Dogs. My goodness, I owe that guy a couple of beers after this game. Thank you, Francis. Oh God, the sinking thing. Oh, I, why does this have to happen? It is, why EA is this a thing in your game? This shows you just how freaking broken your game is. What do I do? What do I do? No, 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 no. What if I go into instant replay? Okay, so the puck is on, it's on their end, and I'm off angle. I'm going to have to play this through the replay. Thank you, EA. All the tension. What's going to happen? Are they going to score? Why is it sinking? This is going to tick me off. It's still doing it. 
I can't tell what's going on. I can't even play the game. Yep, just simulate the rest of it. It's unplayable, dude. Did we win the game? Hey, look, trying to figure out what a goal is going to look like long term. Wow, six, eight, seven right save percentage. Are you kidding me? I mean, plain and simple. It's a fool's game to try to sit there and predict. But I will say this. From what I've seen and the amount of games that I have called involving him this year, he's a great puck stopper. And so if a couple of scouts want to knock his play and bring him down on their draft rankings based on a handful of games, a small handful of games in a cluster, then well, so be well, it. Well, that's fun. All I know is this. If he drops, he's going to be a steal for whoever or whichever team ultimately lands him and takes him in the NHL draft. All right, so we get Oshawa and a rematch with Oshawa. And as we get into the in the next game, now, our save percentage is just terrible, but we have a chance to get it back in order the next time we play this. I don't even know if I'm going to play this because apparently EA don't even know how to make a game without game-breaking glitches. But we will see in the next episode.